so hey there everyone back again with another video and in this video we are gonna learn something more in flutter firstly i want to say sorry about not uploading video from last few weeks because i was just stuck in some work and i had faced a problem that is about the android x problem and i was not able to solve that problem so the, because of that i was not able to upload the video and because of that error i was not able to work on the project about my the food delivery app because we all know that we had completed our uh, restaurant part and we have to move forward toward the client part and the delivery part but for creating the client part i was just working on that and i the point i started the project i faced the problem of the android x so let me show you the error i have resolved it but it will be something like this okay let me just enlarge the image okay with that yeah come on yeah you can see that it is says that the greater failure may be because of android x incompatibility in the flutter app okay so what is this android x firstly we will understand about the android x and then we will move forward to the and uh, documentation part and then i will tell about the steps how we can resolve this because if you are working on the project and if you are working on the latest dependency then you will definitely face this type of problems okay so um, basically if you can if you google out the this thing about uh, once again yeah uh, if you google this error it will just say to merge the um, en enable the multi dex but um, that is not uh, the full solution of the problem okay so android x stand for the extended version of android because we all know that all the dependency that we are fa using has been announced and has been implemented away years later so these dependencies are very much older okay so for working with the new uh, project and for working with the new dependency we have to get the new uh, dependencies but the dependency that we are using in our project that if we create a new project it will the dependencies the android studio give us by default our very old dependency so android team has made the new android x uh, support library that works on the latest dependencies okay so let's move on to the official or the documents of the uh, flutter and the android x firstly we will just go to the android um, what you can say uh, official page so it says that android has mapped the original support library api to the android namespace basically it just says that it has just refactored all the um, older dependency into a newer dependency okay and it will show some of the steps okay and it this thing is that all the uh, old thing has been re refactored like this okay so we are not gonna do or um, learn uh, see these things okay and let's go to the flutter compatibility okay flutter compatibility says that we have to just to uh, get the dependency of this okay let me enlarge it okay it says that the we have to go to the greater dependency and change each and everything these are or if you don't want to use the android x dependency you can just uh, enable the uh, dependency in the pubsec.yml of these things okay but i will recommend you to do the thing that i'm gonna tell you because it will definitely remove all the errors that we will face okay so uh, let me show you the thing that android give us by default okay so if we go to the gradle file in the app level gradle file we can see that the, these are the by default uh, implementation that android studio gave us okay so these are very old dependency and with the imp uh, advancement in the time and the dependency always include some new features so the android x has uh, refactored each and everything we are not gonna go in detail about that okay so let me just uh, go to my android studio okay and you have seen what is the error we are not gonna uh, do these things uh, what the uh, site says okay 
okay let me just cut it off okay so this is my project it has resolved all the dependencies but i am going to tell you these steps that you what you will be doing so that you may not face the android x depend error okay so when you and one thing for uh, doing this thing uh, the steps i'm going to tell you you should have android studio more than version 3.3 okay because before and or the 3.0 version will not do the thing that i'm going to tell you okay so what we are going to do is that we will go to the project level okay okay one second so in that you can see that we have all the things okay and we have a android folder we have a ios folder okay and if you are using vs code so for that this folder you have to open the android studio and and open this folder in your android studio okay so if uh, you know that i am uh, doing each and every thing in my android studio so i have to just right click over it come on okay and you can see that we have a flutter option here okay and flutter we have to just uh, click on the open android studio in new 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 window okay so it will just open the and uh, android part in the new window okay so this is just opening okay let us just wait for a few seconds yeah okay so the point you will uh, open the android part in the um, new window it will start syncing okay and it will resolve all the dependency that the android should have okay and it will run and the uh, uh, rebuild all the things and it will include all the dependency that your project should have okay and if it uh, ask for you to upgrade your android or upgrade your gradle just ignore that because we don't want to upgrade our gradle okay so let's just wait for the uh, process to happen okay i think it's done one second only it will not take much time okay and after that the point these things are over at the point the gradle sync has been done okay it will sync it will definitely sync the project you just have to go to this refactor part okay and you can see that one second let me let it happen okay let it just um, uh, build the gradle okay because i'm i don't want to cut the video so we will just wait for a few second it will download some of the dependencies also because um, the point you uh, start re rebuilding the gradle it will definitely download those things so let us wait for a few seconds okay so let's wait and yeah guys and if you haven't um, subscribed to my channel just subscribe to our channel because i always bring the latest things of um, um flutter and yeah if this thing happens okay and if asks you to upgrade the gradle just um, ignore it okay they don't remind me again for this project okay and it will be done in it will after that will just uh, index the application okay it will not take much time okay so um and uh, i'm going to definitely start the next part with the uh, food or the client part of our app because i know that we were making the food delivery app so let me see has it gone okay so it is indexing okay let us wait because the system is working okay so if you haven't liked my channel just subscribe to my channel and give this video like if you like it and if you don't like something just write down in the comment section and i will definitely get back to you on that okay and uh, just um, uh, like our facebook page and instagram page because the work i do on Insta uh, other than the youtube part i just upload the screenshot of each and everything on the uh, uh, instagram page okay and on the facebook also so let's see okay so it's scanning the file for indexing gradle has been finished let it be finished okay so it's indexing
let it be okay okay so it's now done each and everything is done so we can just um, go and go in the project part it will show you this these things are basically converted to the android dex dependent and why this folder has been generated i don't know but the, these things the uh, firebase auth firebase core firebase database and each and every thing that we see here folder we see here are the dependency that we include in the uh, pubsec and dot yaml file okay so if it's done just go to the refactor part and click on the migrate to android x okay it will ask you to back up your project okay mm, because um, my project has been what you can say backed up already so i am not gonna back up okay so it will just look for the uses and it will just convert your uh, project to android x okay as my project is already in the android x part so it is not uh, doing anything but if your project is um, not uh, compatible for the android x it will definitely convert that and it will show you the success dialog okay let me show you what will happen when you convert the uh, project to the uh, <coughs> android x okay so just we can go to the gradle okay not this gradle we'll go to the android part we will open the gradle okay so okay why gradle auto import okay let me okay so this thing we will not we go to go to app part and yeah when we open this uh, thing you can see that we have converted each and everything in android x android x and one thing more yeah this is the android x okay and in the gradle properties we have included the android x okay and one thing more we as we go in the gradle wrapper property it has automatically included these things okay so this is the way you can do this don't go for the method that the android x compatibility of the flutter page says because it will show the um, error and on google or somewhere else um, people will definitely say just go and import uh, download the uh, a, 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 sorry 28th api okay so i have done that and i have faced the same problem after downloading that okay so i will recommend you to follow these steps so that you won't uh, so feel the error or don't uh, face this type of error again in your life okay the point you create the flutter project go for the android x that's the thing and even though if you are creating the android project in java just select for the android x artifact there is a checkbox at the bottom so just checkbox there because you don't face problem in future okay so that's all for today guys if you like the video just give it a thumbs up and share with your friends thank you have a nice day